Welcome to Research Business Daily Report. Named one of the top podcasts in marketing research and the industry's only daily research video blog. It's made possible by RBDR's exclusive community at the crowdfunding platform patreon.com forward slash RBDR. I'm Bob Letter for 25 years, the respected voice in market research. Not quite one month ago, RBD are reported on Unilever's unstereotyping process for its advertising. It's a broad-based attempt to eliminate harmful and personally diminishing portrayals of women in advertising. Unilever representatives shared the fact that progress had been made in that area, and the company publicly stated its intention to not only share its findings, but hopefully to assist companies across the board in achieving the same better situation for women in their advertising. One company that may not require that assistance is Mars. So reported Kim Benjamin for CampaignLive.co.uk. She had attended the Cannes Lions Festival of Creativity and found out about what Mars has been up to. The company says it has a commitment to close the gap on gender representation and stereotyping both in its marketing and its advertising. Mars is using research that demonstrates its own advertising campaign shortcomings, and ironically, it's being used to urge the industry to better reflect the diversity of consumers in advertising across the board and around the world. The project by the Gina Davis Institute on Gender and Media at Mount St. Mary's University examined more than 200 Mars Global television ads, and it concluded that Mars brands perform better than the industry baseline when it comes to diversity. However, more work needs to be done with gender representation. A couple of reasons. First, a 3 to 2 ratio in the number of men versus women that were represented in Mars advertising, with the males almost twice as likely to be shown working than were the females. Additionally, 26% of the men in the Mars commercials were shown to have an actual profession. Compare that with the 11% for the women in the ads. 22% of the men were shown as leaders. Only 17% of the women were depicted the same way. Mars Wrigley Chief Category Officer Berta de Pablos commented, quote, Mars has a responsibility to shape the world that we want tomorrow. The best ads take on the responsibility to accurately reflect society. And we hope that by releasing some of our findings from the Institute, that we can encourage the large industry to prioritize the equitable inclusion and representation of women, end of quote. That's your research business. Delhi Report has been made possible by our crowdfunding platform at patreon.com forward slash RBDR. RBDR is produced Monday through Thursday most weeks, thanks to the interest and the support of our viewers. And we work diligently every day to make this video worth their investment, both in its quality and its continuation of RBDR. You probably don't know that it takes about seven hours to produce each RBDR, beginning with a daily internet search for high-impact information, knowledge, and opinions worthy of being condensed and shared with RBDR's audience. Then 30 minutes to decide which discovered bits of information make the cut in order to be presented on RBDR and how we're going to do so. Followed by two hours for script creation, rewriting, and fine-tuning. And 30 minutes to tape each video report. And finally, two hours for our crack production team to produce the final product. And by the way, that doesn't include the time that we spend working with each of our guest commentators, which we love to have. Now, we hope that you agree that the five minutes or so that you spend with RBDR, whether it's all four days a week or maybe once or twice or three times a week, is time well spent. Because the Internet may be perceived as a free zone, but we believe that a $5 or $10 or whatever level of patronage that is comfortable for you as a monthly contribution is really not much to ask. So, please visit patreon.com forward slash rbdr where you can show your support. And if you make a commitment, be sure to share your thoughts about subject matter you'd like to see us discuss further or maybe for the first time, or perhaps guests you would like to hear from. Have a great research day, and we'll look forward to seeing you back here tomorrow.